Hi guys, I have a Bath & Body Works candle haul for you today. It is my birthday today, so all of these candles were gifts from my husband. First, let's start off by one word. Enter Stellar. Amazing. Matthew McConaughey. Fucking amazing. It was good. Jose liked it. I liked it. It was just good. So, let me start off by saying that their candles were still two for 22 today, and I used a $10 off of 30 coupons, so I got four candles for, for $37 after taxes. So I think that is pretty good. Let's just get started. First, I got winter, and can we just talk about the packaging this year? Look at this. It's very, very glittery. All up here is all glittery, and look at the Snowflakes, so cute, so cute. Love it. This is an old favorite and a staple, I feel, of every winter and holiday season. A fragrance that captures the essence of being in the mountains with bracing notes of pine needles, winter citrus, and white woods. Uh, basically what I get is a pine note kind of in the background, but I also get an ozoniness to it, and I also get like a fireside note, obviously with no marshmallow. To me, it reminds me of a bonfire outside on a really cold fall night. It's really, really good. It's not quite cold enough, in my opinion, to melt this yet, so I will be saving it for a couple weeks. Next, from the same line, I got Vanilla Snowflake, and I'm not ashamed to admit that a big part of the reason I got this candle was because of the gorgeous table on it. And it's got the same snowflake lid. And I've never gotten this one before. The scent description is a bright and joyful blend of sweet vanilla, peppermint, and icy mint that captures the fun adventures of a snow-filled day. I don't get much mint at all peppermint or otherwise. It's mostly just a really sweet vanilla. I think it's something good that's kind of laid back. All right, this was a repurchase from last year. This is cinnamon frosting. Um, it's got the really, really pretty bow. It's got the gift tag and it's got the really pretty uh, frosting heart. And the lid is like a little bakery tartlet that's made with love. It's like a hammered aluminum, very country. And this is not everyone's taste, I know that, but it's my taste and I think it's gorgeous. Cinnamon frosting to me, it smells like a straight up cinnamon and cream cheese frosting. So, such a staple for me uh, of Christmas. I just absolutely love this scent. Love it, love it, love it. It is like my favorite scent. The last candle I got, Merry Mistletoe. And they do not come with lids. They instead come with these little cardboard. Obviously, I don't want to have an open candle sitting around for an undetermined amount of time. However, I went ahead and let myself buy this one because I, because I knew I had an extra lid. I'm considering getting some kind of glue and gluing this to the top so that I do have some kind of decoration on it. But this is just delicious. It smells fresh balsam, and let me just say the fresh balsam is usually every year my go-to pine scent. It's my favorite. I love it. There's just something about it. It's just so strong, and so it's such a strong pine scent, but at the same time, it is so, so sweet, and it's just a really good, unique, yummy pine scent. I was in the store, and I had pretty much in my, the back of my mind assumed that fresh balsam would be my second pick of candles, but when I got there and I was in the store, I wasn't feeling it. I do know that my family Christmas candle arrived in the mail at work today while I was not there. So that may have been part of what swayed me from buying Fresh Balsam because it's not the family Christmas from Front Porch smells similar or is it is a pine scent. It's got pine in it, but it just kind of, the two scents are kind of similar, kind of in the same family. I knew that I did want a pine scent. I mean, you know, I'm getting really excited for Christmas. I'm just so excited for Christmas, so I knew I wanted a pine scent. So, Merry Mistletoe. Or the scent description is... Put a twinkle in someone's eye with the flirty and festive blend of cranberries, pears, frosted citrus, and a hint of holiday greenery. To me, I would never, before reading the scent description, I would have never described it as a hint of holiday greenery, but 
I get that. I get that. I definitely like kind of like a pine mixed with cranberry pear bellini. That may be why I like it so much. That was my haul. I'm super, super Thanks excited. Thanks for watching. Remember, live life in your own shade of awesome. That's the only thing that matters. Have a good night. Bye. This is probably the first movie I've ever seen Matthew McConaughey be in where I'm not constantly thinking about how sexy he is. On somehow. I heard something in the fucking window. That's creepy. I, I think I want a dog.